Welcome to Sleepy High Wickham. Where a cottage industry has sprung up that offers ordinary women a taste of the glamorous photo shoot and Photoshop world. 28-year-old teacher's assistant Nicola wants to get the perfect shot as a present for her fiancé on her wedding day. While I'm waiting for magazines to call me back, I've come to observe Nicola's shoot. I love Owner Alex charges up to £3,000 for a full-day shoot and retouched photo album. Nicola has battled with her own body image for years and hopes this session will be cash well spent. If you look at, like, all the pictures on the walls and stuff, they're skinny, they've got perfect skin. It's drilled in from you at a young age. Mm. You go, yeah, you've got to be this, you've got to be that, you've got to be this. And you think, well, if I'm not that, then I must be... Must be fat, must be ugly. When you have photographs taken just like with your mates and stuff, do you hate it? Really? Absolutely hate it. It's like the belly, it's a bit muffin toppy, saddlebags. I think my legs curve too much at the calves. Yeah, everything. So do you think then by having these photographs done, this is your your own way of getting back that confidence that you want to have so much? Yeah, definitely. My main aim for this is to go, when I'm walking down that aisle, rather than criticising myself in my head with 150 people looking at me, thinking, I've had them pictures done, I can do this, I do look good. <laughs> do you know what, pink's my favourite colour. Is it? Brilliant. Shimmy on down a little bit more, that's great. Naked right now. <laughs> you look like you've been doing this for years. <laughs> Eyes at the camera this time. I can see that the process is really boosting Nicola's confidence. Because of the digital age, we're just that much closer to being able to achieve perfection. In 2005, I noticed that every single person I spoke to was absolutely focused on the retouching and really would only feel confident to have a photo shoot like this if they knew that there was retouching involved. Any kind of little um, idiosyncrasies can be retouched mm -hmm. and um, fixed, basically. You can be fixed. Work it, own it, make it yours. <laughs> There's another reason Nicola's keen to get over her body image issues. In the three years we've been together, he still hasn't seen my bum. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, it's, it's really bad, though, isn't it, that, we, that women feel like that? It affects the intimacy that you have with your partner. Kick your hip out a little bit. Instead of thinking of the time you're together, you think, right, I've got to suck my stomach in, I've got to get my bum into that angle. Mm. So, yeah, it does affect everything. Mm. It's really silly. Like your belly Drop dancing. the gown a little bit, though, right? that's it. Woo! We're pretty much done. <laughs> How are you feeling? I think Richard might be lucky enough to see my bum tonight. Yay. First time in three years. Lucky Richard, and good for you. Nervous, I know. <laughs> now Nicola gets to look at the shots. Oh my god! Super big. That's me. Oh, this is you. Not airbrush, nothing, just you. I can't believe that's me. <laughs> that is you. Why shouldn't you have that? <laughs> I've never had a picture where I go, wow, ever. <laughs> but after a while, the old insecurities start to flood back. I think I'd like my bum to be smaller. Really? See, my, I think my arms look chubby there. Really? Yeah. Despite loving the photos, Nicola still insists on getting them retouched. Can you take my arm hair away? <laughs> no problem. <laughs> She grew in the photo shoot. She was getting more daring, she was taking more risks. But she wanted to change her body shape, and there's nothing wrong with it. It's beautiful. I last saw Nicola two months ago at her photo session. She was so insecure. Her fiance had never seen her bum. <laughs> Whatever. Are you serious? Honestly. Does that mean that he has seen your bum now? Oh, Are you serious? Has he seen your bum? Oh, yeah. What, with lights on? Nothing on. Oh, I'm so proud of you. 